Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. This is Rishab and Priyansh from Ascending Techie and today we're going to show you how we created a code that functions similar to a gaming mouse but instead of the mouse, we use gestures as an input. So, what does it do? The code uses the webcam of your device, mostly your laptop or your PC for gesture recognition. Whenever a gesture is performed, it checks which application is open or active or the selected window and based on that it will execute the command. If the active window is not recognized or you are on your desktop then the code will perform whatever command the default profile has been assigned to. For now we have created four profiles that is the default, Google Chrome, Nautilus that is the file explorer for Ubuntu and VLC media player. Each gesture is mapped to a command specific to that particular profile. For this, we needed a dataset full of gestures to train a model. So after a lot of research, we came across the gesture dataset and from the leaderboard of that dataset, I found a trained model put on GitHub by Fabio Baldessera. Do check out his channel. He did say that he was going to put up content more frequently and without him, this project wouldn't be the same as it is. After we found this, it cut down majority of our work since now we have a working gesture recognition system. We tweaked the code a bit to make it work with our system and added some new code as well which would get the name of the active window whenever required. Then we used PyAutoGUI to map commands to each gesture and create profiles for each application. And then we were done. Thank you.
we have even made a demo banking app based on the application of gesture recognition system check out that video too the link will be in the description if you want to try this yourself install ubuntu 19.10 and not 20 and install all the prequestics mentioned and off you go i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to support us by liking this video and subscribing to the channel until then be kind to everyone